we are very much afraid of neurodegenerative diseases, of dementia. Um, the scientists are saying that they actually don't know the cause of it. And the, popul and the people that are getting dementia, they are getting younger and younger, already get it in their 40s and in their 50s, and it's galloping. That's like an epidemic of Alzheimer's around the world right now, and it's getting all the worse. Now, what we are doing, we're taking all the latest research and we're actually showing that those things that people, that the scientists are saying or said for 10 or 20 years ago, that the accumulation of plaques and tangles in the brain are the cause of Alzheimer's, is outright wrong. It's not the cause, it's the symptoms. And the cause is very different. And there's a lot of the cause. The cause are lifestyle triggers that are triggering some stress pathways in the cells, triggering mutation of DNA, genetic expression of our genes, and triggering the death of neurons. And the neurons, uh, when they are, they have problems, they die, they cannot survive because of a lack of what we call metabolic flexibility. So we're talking about problems with breathing, problems with vasc vascular problems, with blood flow, with lymph flow, sleep dysfunctions, a different uh, side effects of medication, metabolic dysfunctions, what we eat, how we um, get the nutrients inside of the body, inside of the cells, inside of the, our small um, energy works, like inside the cells, we call mitochondria, chronic stress, nutrition, and we have tools you know, to work with all of this. So instead of medication, we have education and physiology. We have working with breathing, with structured movement, with optimization of the sleep, with optimizing normal metabolism, normalizing insulin response, normalizing glucose in the blood, mental resilience, physical and immune resilience too. All of this is inside our program. 50 weeks program in, uh, towards normal health. And this is actually week 32, so we learn a lot of practical tools. And the best of all, it is possible to stop and reverse dementia. It's possible to reverse and stop Alzheimer's and Parkinson's, especially when it's newly diagnosed. And we giving you, we are giving you tools.